just before the video starts, I would like to give a disclaimer that I am talking to somebody. It's just his mic um, was not working. Um, well, not really that that wasn't working, but he had a setting, so I cannot share his um, audio. So, in previous videos, if I make videos with him, I will make sure he turns that on so you guys can hear him. So I don't seem like I'm mentally ill talking to myself. But just keep that in mind. I am having a conversation with somebody. Just sadly, you guys are only hearing one side of the conversation. So, but some of this film, like some of this footage, is quite funny and quite enjoyable. Um, it's one of my, one of the first times I'm actually having fun again in this game. But I'm not gonna waste any more any more of your time. Um, enjoy the video. Like a flashing red light, and if I don't, if I don't turn it off after like it pops up four times, it just randomly turns off my PS4. Um, and it happened mid game. Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. Yep. 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 Yeah. Same. Mhm. Mm yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. 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 This game's weird. Mhm. Mm yeah. This is the only game like I have literally I've seen it overheat before at times. But see, I literally even got things to, like, lift the PS4 up a little bit, and I have a fan on it, and I just cleaned it. Like, I haven't, I've never, after all my years of owning my PS4, I've never once cleaned it. I've got the dust out from the sides, but I've never actually, like, got a washcloth and fucking cleaned that. No, I didn't crack it open, because I don't, like, the, it's like a really weird fucking screw to take it out, and I don't own something at the same size. I own stuff that's a little bit too big or a little bit too small, but not the exact size. And I remember, if I remember correctly, it's a specific tool that you need, and it's not the cheapest thing. So, yeah. Yeah, because I know the old PS4s, like, have the worst problem with collecting lint. And, then, and that's what makes it overheat like fucking crazy. But you know what I don't understand, right? What I do not understand is, this game does not have the best graphics in the world, right? And when I, like, played Warzone or Apex or whatever for literally, like, four plus hours on end, not once did it overheat. It sounds like a fucking jet engine, but it still doesn't overheat, right? But on this game, not even one hour, my PS4 starts overheating. Legitimately, my first, like, dude, I was playing one game, right? It was off for, like, almost all day. I hopped on one game. At the end of round one, it started overheating. To the point where that message. Literally one fucking round. Three minutes. And it was like, yeah, no, you're not playing anymore. It was fucked. But just for reference, it started r after round one, and at the start of round three is when my PS4 shut off. So that's my time frame I got before it turns off. Battle round. Yeah. It starts at random, but then it's a few minutes or whatever until it completely turns off. Oh, God. Just so you guys know, you're going to protect me from that Palpatine. Why? What? Okay, I was about to say, the, my camera angle doesn't look like it was Obi-Wan. But protect me from the Palpatine, because I'm very bad at dealing with Palpy, and I hate him with that. I'm only bad at dealing with him with Sabers. And that's if he has purple cards, because if he's a stamina... Yeah, because he drains stamina like a motherfucker. So, yeah. yeah. What I find an issue, what I find an issue is his fucking stamina drain. It's only maxed out Palpy that I have a problem with. Yeah. Like, that's what I don't understand. It's like, I can block his attack to get close to him, but, oh wait, I can't because it's a Palpatine. You know what I mean? And that's why I personally hate Palpatine. Yeah, so is this Dooku. Dooku's dead. They do like the running away. You know, the hidden, the hidden run is strong with these two. 
Or probably, I think all of them, because I've only fought them all in Duke, so I don't know how, how the other ones are. Yeah, and they try to stick together, but they fail horribly at it. I've been choked. I'm dead. I'm dead, though. Yeah, we both just got choked off the edge, me and Obi-Wan. But I don't really understand how that... Okay, see, if I was doing that as Vader, that shit would have never fucking connected. Is that just me that experiences that? Where you can do, like, the easiest choke of your life and it decides to not connect, but when someone else does one that's a little bit harder, that you would never be able to land, they land it perfectly. Trust me. Yes, okay, cool. <laughs> Voice crack. <laughs> Bye. I feel kind. Why is Vader hiding behind the corner waiting to try to lightsaber throw somebody? Yeah. Being Vader and hiding around a corner is very. Um, I think the lag is because of the fucking Han Solo grenade in your fucking throat. What? Um, you're not moving, by the way. You good? Yep, there goes his internet. Or there goes his nat tag. I think it's gonna do the thing. That's just funny. It's doing the thing. Yep. Oh, I'm choked. Fuck. Luke, I believe in you. Luke and Obi, I believe in you. Luke, I believe in you. <laughs> Considering the other one's dead. There's a Palpy coming up behind you, by the way. Oh, wow, you're getting 1v3'd by a Palpy, Dooku, and Vader. Wow. That's... Wow. That's just wow. Hi, A. I'm assuming you did the thing. A, you gonna speak? Or is your nat type still kind of fucked? Hey, A, you gonna do the thing? <laughs> I thought so when you weren't really moving. Um, can you join back on oh, no, our- Yeah, you should be able to join back. No, there's not yet. There's not yet. Now you will see where the path yeah, and one of them rage quits, so it's three on three. So if you join, we have an advantage. Yeah, that's the only issue. But if it doesn't, I want to try to 1v1 you. But doing a 1v1 in 4v4s will probably be a fucking nuisance. Yeah. But I think we can manage. We'd have a teammate to back this up a little bit if they do try to do the 2v1v4. 1v4. V4. I don't know I'm about 2v1. It's 1v4 in this game mode. <laughs> There's no such thing as 1v2s. Because the game... I'm not, no. Uh, let me play online real quick. There's a Palpy that is just walking past me and not trying to kill the AFK Yoda, but you know. I did let our Luke die, aka Frank, trying to do that, so you owe me one. <laughs> what? There's somebody on our team, though. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> I was a little bit, I was questioning it at first when I realized that that had to have happened. Alright, um, but yeah, if, you, if you're wondering why you didn't hear from me for like a good month, it's because I literally took like a month off this game. Not really, I took like a week off. I came back for like a few days, after like a few days, like a few weeks off, and I wanted to pull my hair out. I literally cussed out my subscribers, and I literally made it call the title, Fuck This Shit Ass Game, and I just disappeared for like two days. <laughs> and then I came back with 12 videos in one day. They're still posted, so it's not technically one day. But you get the point. <laughs> all, all of them were one hour as well, keep that in mind. So it's literally like 12 hours. Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> I, I, you could do six one hour videos a day for like a month. My mental sanity said fuck you. <laughs> videos. No, they, they were not edited. I do, I mostly do unedited content. That's why it was pretty easy. But here recently I've been trying to edit more of my content. But when you have 10 hours worth of fucking content, editing's fucking annoying. So I edited two videos and then I just said, you know what, fuck it, I'm just not doing that shit. I <laughs> just posted it. Yeah. Yeah, see, because with, with PS4 share play as your only editing source, editing's not really reliable. Yeah, drawing's a lot easier to post. See, I usually do drawings on TikTok, but see, the community for drawing on TikTok does not really fucking exist. Well, at least not the drawing I do. The drawings I do kind of just... Yeah, no one understood what the fuck they were. Mainly because, like, like it's not really a dying art form, but not, not an art form that anyone fucking knows. And honest... Um, Mandela... It's basically, it's basically circles and different shapes, but, um, in very, um, large detail. It's called, they're called mandalas. M-A-N-D-A-L-A-S. Yeah. I've been draw, I've been interested in them ever since I was, like, four, because I got a fucking, um, coloring book with them, and I fucking fell in love with them ever since. And it's, like, the only thing, I can draw their stuff if I wanted to pretty well. But, it's the only thing I can truly draw well, because it's the only thing I fucking care about drawing. So, yeah. And I never, I stopped drawing for like 10 years, and then I started again, because my friend told me that I was decent. And I... <laughs> M-A-N-D-A-L-A-S. Yeah. And the things that you see in rugs, it's like the things that you, like, on rugs and, um, stained glass in movies and shit. So, yeah. yeah, you see them, but no one really draws them. Anymore. It's... Yeah. They, they, there is some people that draw them, but they're not very common. I think people that actually draw them for, like, fun and shit, they don't really exist. And see, because my... I have ADHD and all that... So keeping myself still to draw shit very hard and doing symmetrical shit, like, you know, with the, as you saw there, you have to be symmetrical as fuck to draw this, and that's not me. So I use an app, and I use symmetry on said app to make my life easier. Um, and this, one of, like, I, feel, I saw a lot of comments when I was first starting them again, because, like, I didn't ever, I didn't really ever draw them. And when I started, they looked pretty fucking bad, but were still decent. Um, I had a lot of comments saying, like, this is fucking, what, what is this, this is fucking horrible, whatever. And there, well, then I told them, like, it's not as easy as things, like, a lot of fine detail, um, shit that I do. And they were like, I, I don't want to use symmetry, because my ADC and stuff makes my hands, like, I cannot keep my hands still whatsoever. Like, when I used to do art, like, art in school, I had to trace it, and even that was difficult. But, you know, like, because, like, I could not keep my hands still. So I tried to trace Naruto as a joke, and I literally made a Naruto if he was on cocaine. Um, like quite literally. See, I try, but dra me and drawing people don't work. So, yeah, yeah. I used to draw a lot of Pokeballs, like when I was like, like doing school. I enjoy drawing Pokeballs, that's what I do. Um, so. Yeah, not Poke- I, I didn't do Pokemon because, again, my drawing was not the best. But what I did was I traced out the circle because I'm bad at doing all that, and then I just caught- I, I looked at it and then, you know, drew it. Because so, I didn't do completely tracing back then when it came to Pokeballs. But, um, I needed to trace the circle because perfect circle don't exist for me. So. It actually is because I don't know if you know, but if you have to draw a perfect circle, you have to use both sides of your brains, like both both sides of your brain at once, which is a very daunting task if you did not know. It can be learned, yes, but it's still difficult. And see, with my mental issues, yeah, with my mental issues though, learning how to draw is something that I've always, because like I had OCD and all that as well. So if I draw one line that is not correct. 
I crumple up a piece of paper and start again. That's why when I used to draw it angered me so fucking much. Because I would go through an entire notebook on one drawing because if one line did not look right to me, I just crumbled it up and started again. So, yeah. So that's why I didn't do it. And that's why also doing the app is a lot more relaxing and better because I can easily just do undo, you know what I mean? And then start again. Which makes... Exactly, exactly. And see, even like the, with the Apple Pen and like doing all that, it's just as useful, it's like, it's just as impressive as drawing. It's just, you have an undo button of symmetry to make perfect circles. You know what I mean? Because even with symmetry and doing that, the mandalas, like, I do mandalas like, with really fucking big detail. And even with that, like, saying that a nine-year-old could draw these if they had a symmetry is very unrealistic. You know what I mean? Like, and I know that, and that's why I, I thought I didn't really take the insults too funny. But, like, when I first started, the people that were hating on me when I first started, I made a video about, like, of me doing it better. And the funny thing is, like, you're still shit. It's what a lot of happened. But it's funny, because I know I'm not. <laughs> so... Because, yeah, I don't, I've never had an ego about, like, hardly anything. Like, I have egos when, I, when I'm in an argument. Because if you don't have an ego in an argument, you're not winning the argument. You know what I mean? Um, why do we have two Kylos? Are we doing a duplicated glitch here? I don't like that. Yeah, but I fought three Vaders before in Hero for the Villains, and I'd rather not do that. Yeah. And we've all, and the thing is, alright, I, I had one of the Vaders that did it. Say that I was an absolute fucking nuisance to kill, and I was just a little Yoda. And I had three Vaders on me, and I still... I literally have the video on my YouTube channel. It was fucking hilarious. But here, do you want to see... Because like, I don't have, I don't think I have many vid um, of the images that I draw on my phone. But do you want to send... Do you want me to send you a few that I have drawn? Because I don't know if I have most of them, but I... Oh, no, I do. Okay. Um, do you want me to send you, like, my two favorites? Like, my most detailed? See, the one I'm sending you right now is, was, um, I drew it right after a girl that I, ha I was a very good friends with for, like, a, multiple years, and then I had a small crush on. Once she, um, she broke up, like, she didn't really break up with me, but we ended our friendship, and I don't know if it's the first one or the second one, but I'm pretty sure it's the second one that I'm sending you that I drew that with this, because, like, when I draw, I just, like, draw, but that was the first ever drawing I ever made that actually had emotion put into it, and is by far my best one. Like, easily. So yeah, when you have a chance, it's the second one. So yeah, it made drawing less than a, less than a habit, like less than a hobby, and more of a, something I really actually enjoy. Which is quite funny, because I haven't drawn- I haven't drew anything in like... How <laughs> the fucking is something weird? We did it cut off. Bro, my man is unlucky. Oh, he just fell off. Oh, we're not. Bro, how did I hit him from there? Jesus, fuck. Poor Luke. You find yourself in a situation. Oh, that wasn't Luke, that was everyone. I'm retarded. How are you hitting through my block, sir? That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. Alright. He will be back soon. That warrior, he's a master of dark touch. BBA fuck you. Shall we continue? Stay away from these people. Vader, I literally delivered you that loot. Ah, I got
bullshit, dude. I did not put it, click it right there. I thought I went right past that, but whatever. Shit happens. And see, the reason I don't get too mad about this game anymore is mainly because I know this game's a buggy piece of shit now. And that if something doesn't work well, I know it's not my fault. <laughs> Completely, at least. So it's making me rage a lot less. I love kicking a soccer ball. It's always good fun. Who pushed me there? What is this Anakin? What Anakin, what are you hitting? Besides nothing. Welcome back. <laughs> I feel that. <laughs> I feel you. I feel you. Have you ever- I- dumb question here. But have you ever tried uninstalling it or reinstalling it? I'm assuming you have, right? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> also, another dumb question. Because I've had this happen with Apex, when like the game just crashes a lot. But when I made a new account and played it on there, it worked. Have you tried making a new account and trying it on there? True, but you can play, <laughs> and you can also act like a smurf, like act like you're a noob, and then absolutely body people. It's a lot of fun, really. But it's funny. See, I was forced to be a smurf. I didn't want to. I was forced because my main account was banned for two months. Well, my main account was perm banned, and then my second, my new main account was banned for two months. You see, I'm forced to play on this new account. And see, the re how I was banned was completely bullshit. And I think I made a video about it, but I... Yeah. I think you know the story. Yeah. 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 I didn't call him the wrong name. I was talking to Frank, and he thought I was talking to him. And he didn't realize that. And he, would re he refused to admit that he was wrong. And then he called me a cunt, and called my girlfriend obese, and then said he was joking about calling my girlfriend obese. And then he went to my girlfriend's Reddit, and said that she, that I always said she was obviously in an abusive relationship because I was winning an argument. And then when he, when she said, um, no, you're in the wrong here, you're being fucking retarded, he, he then replied to her saying that she was a dyke because, yeah, because he was being a simp and she declined the simpatry. Um, because we've met, uh, because he was begging people to play with him on Reddit, and my girlfriend found it and told me his, um, gamer tag, and then we, I added him to the DC. Yeah, so that's w how this started. So, yeah. Yeah, see, and the thing is, alright, I, the, it all started because I was talking to Frank, and he didn't, and I told, and I said, I said your name above, are you slow? And he said, I ain't slow, cunt, right? And then he goes on to, as you can see in the chat, goes on to talk some really good shit. But, um, what eventually happened was I kicked him out because I didn't want you guys to be bothered by it because we were talking and spamming a little bit. Okay. But the reason I kicked him out was because he, me and him were talking back and forth a lot and I didn't want to bother the other 10 people in the GC. So I kicked him and took it into private. Uh, okay. There goes his nap type again. Alright, when he joins back, I'm just gonna tell him to not hop on, I just wanna talk to him. Cause that's unlucky. Frank, how do you always get first? It's like a guaranteed thing. It's like a guaranteed thing, I swear. Um, Annihilation, dude, I'm so close. Veteran Dolphin Dark Mall, um, does this, no. Which one gives me the skin for Mall? Is it Veteran Dark Mall? Is it, or is it not? Dude, let me know, is it Veteran Darth Maul that gives me, um, the challenge Veteran Darth Maul that gives me his skin or not? By the way, quit, because since he's not going to be able to play with us, I, we can just play Heroes with him. So.
Oh yeah. Cool. Give me a quick second. Hey, oh. Hello. All right. So, what was the last part that you heard? So I know where to start off. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I, I called and then I asked, are you slow? And he called, he said, I ain't slow, cunt. And then, obviously, he called, they said, apparently, he apparently said that my girlfriend was obese, but he never actually said that, but he apologized for it, and talked to her on Reddit, saying that, here, I guess he pulled the messages, hold on, because I have access to her Reddit. So, let me see exact, because we said the Reddit that time, let me see exactly what he wrote, because I can send you exactly what he wrote, I can send you the exact conversation. That went on. Um, let's see. Oh, and do you want to know why? So again, I called him slow when he said that he's not slow, right? But do you want to know how I know for a fact he's slow? Because I, because he said I had no friends, right? And I said, well, look in the GCU with ten other people that I, I clearly have friends that play this game, right? But um, the part of it was right that I asked him if you're saying that I don't have friends, yet you were the one that was begging people to play with you on. Reddit? Like, really? And I'm I'm the one with no friends? And then he said exactly what I'm saying here. Exactly, word for word. He said, I was looking for an extra per- I was ex- uh, English. I was- I'm pretty sure this is what he said. So, don't- I'm, it's like, pretty accurate. But, he said, I was looking for a person for my trios- or, hold on, what was it? Also something? It was basically- oh, my brain! It, it was so fucking retarded, my brain just doesn't work. But he said I was looking for a person... Eh, no, I was... It was something about, something about his trio, and he was looking... No... Yeah, I remember. Yeah, I remember it. I remember it. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. Yeah, he was looking for a fourth person for his trio. Yeah. Yeah. And he's not slow. He's not slow. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. And the thing is, though, right? Yeah. It's exactly, it's exactly. But the thing is, though, right? Instead of, instead of, you know what he could have done to finish the argument? Why are you trying to one v two? But what the fuck? Maul was just we were having an awful fight, and he just like, turned to Frank. And then when I tried to kill him for it, and then just both of them just went for me. These are some cowards. All right, but what I was trying to get at is instead of like what he could have done to win the argument is, you know, for instance. Instead of arguing this pointless argument, because obviously he was not going to give in, and neither was I because he said I was an abusive boyfriend because I was winning an argument, and I'm not going to take you saying an abusive boyfriend to lightly, right? But, pretty much, what he could have done was be the bigger man and say, you know what, this ain't going nowhere, let's 1v1 to decide who's right. Not even once did he bring that up. Yeah. You know the most bullshit thing? I reported, I reported him for saying cunt because I was just done with his shit, right? And yet, I was the one that was banned. Yeah. And see, I was actually the most polite I have ever been in an argument. Quite literally. And you know what the funny part is? So, do you remember? Did I tell you how I was term banned? So, do you know what? Do you know the game Rust? I'm just gonna let this guy kill me. Alright, so do you know the game Rust? You know, like, kind of like Ark? 
So you know like in Ark or whatever, you can inside people, do you know what insiding means? Okay, so it's like when you're like in a clan or a tribe in the game, and they gain your trust, and then they get your codes to your base or whatever, and then they, when you hop off or whatever, they change your codes and take all of your shit. Pretty much. Yeah, yeah. And so this guy did it, Tim and his friends did it to me, right? And I said, WTF, bro. Literally exactly what I just said. Not even, what the fuck. Exactly what I said. WTF, bro, right? And him and his friends reported me. And I was permanently banned for saying WTF. Do I know the reasoning I was banned for? What well, P.L.A.C. just said I was banned for. Racism, sexism, and hate speech against religion. Yeah. Yeah, I was permanently banned for saying WTF. Yet the reasoning was racism, sexism, and hate speech against religion. And do I know, and the thing is, right, do you know what makes it even funnier? Do you know what makes it even funnier? This happened a day after I was unbanned for a month. Do you want to know how I was banned for a month? So my friend that I've known for years, right, he asked me out and I politely declined, right? He didn't like that very much and reported me. Again, I was banned for racism, sexism, and hate speech against religion because I declined a male's invitation to being his boyfriend. Exactly. And the thing is, though, right? See, my for my seven day ban was legitimate. I was sending hentai to people. That ban I will accept. Okay. We don't question that. Well, the real reason is this guy asked for it, and when I sent it, he didn't like it, so he reported me. But I'll accept it. Okay, because I'm proud about that ban. Okay, I'm proud about that one. But see, you know my Iron Man account? See, I really, when this guy, when I got banned, I really thought I was going to be a permanent banned. But do you want to know my third, my, my seven day ban and my one month ban for that this other account was for? It was, so this guy again, another guy inside of me, right? And I called him an inciting fag, right? And I was banned for seven days randomly. I was like, and I asked him, why did you get me banned? He said, because you called me the F word. I said, which one? F-A. I was like, oh, so you're a faggot then. I was then banned again. But even the funniest part about it is, I was pretending like it was an autocorrect and I didn't want to get banned and like begging him not to report me. <laughs> but then I was like at the end, I was like, my guy, I legitimately have three other accounts. I really don't give a shit if I get banned. Then five minutes later, I was banned. <laughs> that was quite amusing. And so you know the funny part is though, while my main account was banned for a month, Right? Why well, was banned for a month? My Not dealing with
like, I have a lot of mudkips and I don't know what to do with it if anybody wants them. Um, and one of the guys is like saying, oh, good flame body will make it go faster. And I know this, but I forgot, and I didn't honestly have it added. And one of the guys said, why Palkia? Because I had one Pokemon in my party, and it was Palkia. And people were like, why, though? Why Palkia? And I was like, why not? Because pe people, people are surprised about this because what is your favorite gen? Be honest. Okay, fair enough. Mine's a very rare one that no one really talks about. Gen 4 and 5 are my favorite. Black and white and diamond and pearl. Uh, people hate on bl bl um, black and white and diamond and pearl quite a bit. Actually. Yeah, pe people say after Gen 3, Pokemon was shit. From what I've heard. A lot of people say that. That after Gen 3, Pokemon just turned into a shit show. Which I don't completely, I complete, kind of agree with, because Pokemon-wise, I agree. Diamond and Pearl was a season that Pokemon became fucking weird. Because that's when you were introduced to the Ice Cream Pokemon. And then it was the Apple Pokemon in Gen 8. Yeah. So Pokemon-wise, those were the dying seasons. And I can agree with that. Black and White and Diamond and Pearl were the last decent seasons in Pokemon. X and Y was decent, but it was a lot weirder than it should have been. Well, I was getting chased by a fucking Aiden and a fucking Boba, so it's not working out for my mental sanity. I know, but I'm just saying. <laughs> Yeah, I know what you meant, but yeah. But did I give you my YouTube, by the way? Have you watched any of my shit and be honest? I'm assuming not, right? I meant my YouTube, you smartass. <laughs> uh, okay. I was about to say, I thought you were just being a smartass. Like, no, I've never watched YouTube. I just work. <laughs> I thought you were being a smartass. <laughs> I thought you were being a smartass. <laughs> yeah, I just work. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were being a smartass. <laughs> okay, okay, I see, I see, I see. I'm usually dealing with complete assholes. Because PS4. Fuck, Bosk! I... Please kill this fucking boss. I hate blasters on Dark Stride. They're so obnoxious. Like, they're not better than the light side blasters, but they're just fucking annoying. Domination. Find that light side. Well, Han and, Han and Lei are the only two good blasters, in my opinion. You know what I mean? Just my current opinion on that, but yeah. See, my, my highest, my second highest, no, third highest level is Han. Because I, in my, in my opinion, you should know how to play at least one boss, if you're, or one blaster. Because if you're in Hero Showdown, for, if you win every round, if you, on, by, by round three, um, you have, one of you has to play a blaster. So I say, for each side, you gotta learn at least, learn how to play at least one blaster. And for me, it's, on dark side, it's legitimately any blaster that I think I'm able to get kills with. Because I'm not very good with any blaster um, on dark side, but my number one is Han for life side. So. Yeah, I like Boba, but using him and aiming him, like aiming with him effectively is difficult for me. Well, only aiming with him in the air, that is. Yeah. yeah, I don't play like the average boss. I'm, I I play kind of cowardly because only because if your boss are not boss. Why am I keep saying boss? If I can retard it. If you're boba, if you don't like do the kind of hit and run kind of strategy, you're not gonna last long because one saber can whoop your ass if you're um, what's it called? If you're um, if you're knocked out of the fucking sky, you're just dead. You know what I mean? 
That's the one thing I don't really like about him. Because if literally, if you get knocked out of the air, you're just dead. It's just as simple as that. You're fucking dead. Can somebody back me up with this Vader? Please? He's dead. Cool. That didn't last long. Yeah, my kills right now are really bad, but I'm also in the middle of, I'm, not, I'm more focusing on talking than anything. Because I know you guys will carry me. <laughs> oh, I didn't. You're a bitch. Jesus, stop with the fucking hacks, bro. That ain't even the fuck. Fucking stop with the hacks. Guys, save me. Save Master Yoda. Ow, fuck. AC, quick question though. Considering you have a mic and, well, Frank doesn't. I really. Oh no. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> oh, don't worry. I always move around. So if you're, if you want, if you're, I stop moving, then you're probably lagging. Cause I don't know if you noticed, but I don't stop moving. <laughs> so. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, if you ever want to know if you're lagging, you just see if I stop moving. Cause I rarely stop moving. So, yeah, if I stop moving, then yeah, you're probably right. Dude, I just love how we just triple fucking, um, triple, um, yes, triple push that item. Love that. Yeah. Dude, I've met somebody with, a, I've met multiple max level items, and I wonder why they exist. What? I didn't even kill the boss, he just fucking collapsed. He fucking respawned once I knocked him on his ass. I literally think I fucking made the boss just respawn. Like, cause he, I hit him, I knocked him on his ass and then I went to go kill him and he just fell over. He literally just fell over and died. Bitch literally just fell over and died. Where did I get socked from? I don't like that. You guys, I don't know if you guys know this, but I have a deep hatred for Palpatine. So, yeah. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Whatever do you mean? I literally say that in almost every Battlefront 2 video I have ever made. I always say, pretty much, I have a very deep hatred for Palpatine. <laughs> If you watch any of my Battlefront 2 videos, you will hear it at least once. <laughs> I, he's not bad, he's a good character, I just hate fucking fighting the bitch. Yeah, fighting him is not fun. Yes. Fuck yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Did it actually though? <laughs> Bruh, you're fucking kidding me. You're kidding me. Bruh. <laughs> uh, at least someone else shares my uh, hatred for this game. <laughs> but honestly though, be honest with yourself. Hold on, hold on. Not to be rude to cut you off here. But be honest with yourself. Are you surprised? It's an EA game. No, I'm not. I mean, I'm exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. No. EA's... Yeah. yeah, legit. Like, well, before... Did you know the sad part is that, right? Before they dropped... Before they completely said, fuck this game, they literally took out loot boxes. Like, why? Like, legitimately why? And now if you get a loot box, like a supply drop type thing, and you open it, you get nothing out of it. Like, why? Why? Why go through all that effort just to lose money? Because if, like, if they had crates, they would be making money still. You know what I mean? This game would still be making them more money if they had it. You know what I mean? <laughs> I know. No one cares if they make money. Like, you know the fucking weirdest part? You could still buy crystals. You can't use them. 
pretty much, but you, you can buy them. Only... Yeah, but that's... But who wants that? Who... who why? Why not just use credits? You know what I mean? Like, why not? Credits are a lot... Yeah. Because credits are not the hardest thing to get. I just... I had 101,000 today, before. I've spent most of them, but yeah. I have 9k now, but yeah. And still, like, what's the point of buying them when you can legitimately earn them as well? You know what I mean? Like, why buy crystals when you can earn them? Yeah, but why? But, 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 but why, though? Like, why would you spend 40 bucks for 11,000 when you could theoretically just grind it? And it's a lot more rewarding when you grind your life away to earn it. You know what I mean? You, you get a lot more out of it. You get a certain kind of, uh... Um, what's the word I'm looking for here? You get... You get something more out of it. Yeah. Because this, cause this game ain't shit, so why would you not grind for it? You know what I mean? Yeah. And do you know the fucking sad- Do you know what I honestly hate the most about this fucking game? What I legitimately hate the most about this fucking game. So, Aiden has a one skin that you can buy, right? Aiden! But Vader has no skins. I did. Oh, the- Yeah. Yeah, they should have had, like, you know when he's, like, on the third movie where he's, like, his eyes are all yellow or whatever and shit, and he's, like, mad as fuck, and, like, I forget, like, M Mordor or whatever, I forget that's what it's called, like, with the lava, and he kills all the people and shit, and his eyes are just, yeah, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, they should have had that. Or, or in the first movie, like, when, like, his, because they have it on a mod on PC, but where his, like, um, where it shows, like, his mask off and, like, it's, like, cracked or whatever, and you can see his skull or whatever, you know what I mean? Like, when the burnt flesh. Kylo has a purple lightsaber. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mod, but yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know the sad part of that, dude? I have not watched Clone Wars in so fucking long when I really want to. Again. But I just cannot fucking find the entire series. Is it on there? I didn't find the full series. Really? I only found like I only found the second part. Really? Like I could only find the movie. Not I could only find the movie, not the series. Really? Was it? No, Clone Wars been out for a lot longer than Disney Plus has been out. Wait, they still recently are making Clone Wars, really? Huh. Um, I'll have to log off of... I'll have to log off of the game. Give me a quick second. Let me check. 